I'm sorry to announce, but the audio will only come in on the left side of your speaker for some reason. So, in this video, we see I've finally got the P51 Mustang. So, I haven't used it yet, actually. This is my first match, so I'm hoping it goes well. I'm at about 12,000 feet, so I'm going to level off. And this match has just started. I've given out plans to the whole team on what to do, so hoping they follow my orders and everything goes well. I can't wait to see how this thing maneuvers against the, uh, well, I guess the D3s, the Vals. Or wait, is that the, yeah, that's the Val. What? Okay, we're 14 miles out. This is quite a big map, and I don't get to reload, so if I get damaged, I'm done for already, unless I crash land on the aircraft carrier. Look at that turn. Oh. It's not good actually. But look at the inside. You can see full 360. It's a beautiful plane. What does that mean? No step. Huh. Oh, that's where the guns are. You can't step on there. Okay. Let's turn on our combat flaps. This thing goes really fast, I've se I can see. So what I'm doing is I'm going in for the kamikazes. I, I don't fly historical usually, but I hear the Mustangs really underpowered in arcade, so. Oh, man, this is getting really shaky. Okay, let's turn around. Hello. Oh shit. Well, that's the end of this, I guess. <sighs> okay, so now we're going to be trying arcade with the P-51D. The Mustang. Let's hope it goes pretty well, because I'm hoping it doesn't go too bad, but um... Oh shit, I still select historical, didn't I? Well, I guess we'll be doing a historical battle again, but this time with uh, an ability to land and not having to engage air targets that are AI although I, I bet I'm gonna do pretty poor like just knowing it what the hell's that is that a AI let's get some speed before we go now, let's slightly turn Whoa. Mosquito. What I could tell about this P-51 already is it's a very heavy aircraft. It's just extremely heavy. It is all aluminum or whatever, right? No, not aluminum. It's some sort of metal. I know nothing of aircraft design, like what type or type of materials they used but uh yeah so i guess we're going up against bf 109s or messerschmitts yeah messerschmitt there we go i said it wrong <laughs> 
So what I could tell is this thing gets a very low speed at low altitudes, but with that supercharger at higher altitudes it gets better speed. So we're just gonna listen to the engine, compliment it. Yep, yeah, we're getting up there. Once we hit about 10,000, I guess we'll probably pick up speed. Oh shit, I forgot you could fire your weapons on here while on the map. So what do we have on our team? Let's see. AI, two P51s, including I myself, but they're more advanced. They're the second version compared to the first. We have a Mosquito, a Spitfire. The enemy team lost a player, so... Huh. Once we hit 10,000, I hope we pick up speed. Okay, so we're not picking up speed, I guess I was wrong, I don't know, something. But as you can see here, look at how heavy it is, it's so, oh, oh dear. We're at a good altitude. But we're going to get up a bit higher. Just going to agree with whatever, oh. I hope we're not going up against any FW-190s. Because the 190 could easily take out a Mustang, I believe. It's a fearsome aircraft. Huh. I don't see anyone yet. Oh, there's someone. Where is he? Oh, down below. An HE120? Is that? 129. Oh, shit. I shouldn't dive like that. Okay, let's go in for a turn on him. Whoa, this thing has a badass turn rate. I just wish it was more controllable.
Let's slow down a bit. He's not doing too well. Oh, he's lost an engine. He's going down. So that's one kill. I like the Mustang so far. I wonder how it performs in arcade though. Although I don't like its shakiness, like if I go to turn really heavily it shakes a bit. Oh well. Minor flaw. Another enemy aircraft. Where at? Oh, it's an I-15. I guess we'll go for it. Wonder what that no handheld means, like no putting your hands on this or something. I have no clue. If anyone knows what that is, just post it in the description down below. Because I really have no absolute clue at all what it is. I could engage ground targets. Yeah, why not? And now I go after him. What I like about this uh, Mustang is how closely together the guns are. They're so close and then they're also close to the center. So they hit dead on onto the aircraft. Instead of hitting its wings, it hits main. I should have paid attention there. Fighting an I-15 is kind of unfair, if you look at it right. And I'm low on ammo. Got him. Now I return to base. But that's going to be the end of the video. Don't forget to like if you enjoyed the video and subscribe if you want to see more.